Hey guys, Cece back with another video and today's video is going to round out favorites month with our top 19 purchases of 2019 from Amazon. watching me or my channel just make sure you go ahead click that subscribe button click the little notification bell all that good stuff you also want to make sure you are following me on Instagram at Yvette Loves Beauty that is where I put most of my makeup tutorials so if you guys like this makeup here and you're interested it should be on my Instagram already so go ahead and check it out also make sure you're subscribed to my family vlog channel right here on YouTube at Bradley TV so if you guys have been watching me or my channel or follow me on Instagram or watch my vlog channel or any of that stuff, then you would already know that I'm kind of addicted to Amazon. <laughs> Not kind of. It's like a full on addiction. So I looked up my account from 2019. I placed 131 orders in 2019. 100 and 31 orders in 2019. It's a little crazy, it's a lot crazy, but Amazon is like, I don't know, it's just an addiction. I love it so much. I get pretty much everything from Amazon. You guys know I have three kids, I have one on the way. So we get everything from Amazon around here. I get food items, I get um, nutritional items, I get vitamins, I get travel stuff, hair stuff, skin stuff, I get some beauty stuff from Amazon. I get just all kinds of stuff and it's really convenient because everything gets delivered in one or two days for the most part I also this year started dabbling in clothing and shoes from Amazon and my life has been forever changed <laughs> so we're gonna stop talking and just dive right into these top 19 items and all I can say about this video is you're welcome so I'm just gonna pull everything out in random order. Let's go. The first thing that we have here is the Solimo 91% Isoprol. Iso is that how you say that? Isoprol, whatever, however you say that. Isoprol alcohol, it's just alcohol, okay? And it's in a spray bottle. Whoever thought of this is a genius, by the way, because I've never seen alcohol in a spray bottle in the store, and maybe I was just overlooking it because I never really looked for alcohol, but this is um, just regular rubbing alcohol. I also have peroxide in a spray bottle as well, and it's so easy and so convenient. If you have kids, kids fall and hurt themselves in all types of random different ways. I don't know what they be doing, especially my, my six year old. She like hurts herself doing everything. So having like peroxide and alcohol in a spray bottle to clean wounds and stuff is super simple. Plus if you wear lace front wigs and you glue them down in order to get the glue off and dissolve the glue, you need alcohol. And so this is super easy because I don't have to like pour it from a regular bottle. I can just kind of spray it right on the glue, breaks everything down, wig comes right off, we're good to go. So that, this is, this is amazing. Moving on to the next item, this is my backpack. This is the backpack that I take to work. So I work in a huge like complex, we call it a campus. So at any given time, I'm walking from this side of campus to that side of campus and I need my laptop, I need a notebook, I just need all types of stuff. And so when I go to work, I take like my personal bag with all of my personal items in it and then I also have a backpack in which I keep my work laptop and then like I said, some notebooks and some other stuff. So so this is what I mainly travel across campus with and so it just has so many pockets and compartments like I have like a pocket over here you could put a water bottle in it or I have oh my wireless mouse which I've also got from Amazon and then you open it up and you just have all of these different compartments so you have this front compartment this like little medium sized compartment and then this big this is the main compartment in here where I keep things and I mean this backpack is just awesome it's super sturdy I go through backpacks like crazy because I'm stuffing them like crazy and so the straps always break but I have found two really good ones from Amazon that I really love and this is one one of them this is like my favorite because it's the most stylish so I love that backpack and it just works out perfectly for my job so next I have these necklaces right here 
I actually just got these in December, but they're so cute that they made the top 19 of the year and I just absolutely love them. You guys have been asking where I purchased them from and they were Amazon. These were like $9.40, so I ended up getting two of them. I got an M and I mean, if you guys know me and my family, everybody in my family's name, my immediate family starts with an M, my husband, my kids, all of them. And then I got a C because that is what my name starts with. So some days I will wear the M, some days I will wear the C. They haven't faded or anything like that. And for $9, you really can't beat it. I'll just buy another one. But they're so cute and I just absolutely love them around my neck. I've been wearing them like crazy and I just think they're awesome. They have every single letter and so you can get multiple letters without breaking the bank. Speaking of jewelry, I'm gonna post a clip here of this jewelry shelf that I grabbed from Amazon. All right, you guys, so here we are inside of my closet. Like you just walk in, this is kind of my closet door. You walk in and then I have the jewelry stand right here. So it's super duper sturdy. Like I said, my husband put this up and he is the least handy person I've ever met. So it's really sturdy and I just keep little things on top. So I keep some earrings on top. Um, stuff I haven't even opened yet I just kind of sit those up there and then this is also where I keep all of my sunglasses so all of these sunglasses are key brand also <laughs> except for these these are like a little I don't know what those are but the rest of these are key brand sunglasses because I love them so much and then I keep necklaces and bracelets here so I just have a few and I kind of sit them up here I'm not a big jewelry person as you guys know so I don't have a lot of jewelry, but this is really nice to hold things. So you can hold necklaces, you can hold bracelets, but then you also have this little holder right here, which can hold like small stud earrings that you can just kind of put in here. So this is really nice and it holds a lot of stuff. So is that not everything? It was super easy to install. My husband did it and he is not handy at all. So it was super easy to put on the wall and it's so sturdy and I just, I love that in my closet. So did you know you can get Louis Vuitton from Amazon? Did you know? Like I got my, okay, it's not Louis Vuitton. It's not real Louis Vuitton. It's kind of knockoff, but who cares, right? This is so cute. This is the um, like knockoff Louis Vuitton makeup bag. I forgot what this print is called. I actually have a, an authentic Louis Vuitton Neverfull in this same print and I love it. But I found this on Amazon for about 20 bucks um, in 2019. And so I really wanted to share it with you guys because um, this is pretty freaking awesome. Like this, first off, the makeup bag is so large. It is so good for travel. I have taken it traveling with me a couple of times and am just in love with it. I actually have a trip coming up very soon that I will be taking this along, putting all of my makeup and my makeup brushes in here and it just fits so, so much. It also has like a little side pocket. It has two side pockets on this side and then it has a zippered pocket like right here on this side. So all of your stuff fits. If you want to use it for toiletries, if you want to, you, you want to use it for like some small electronics, you can. It's just, it's super awesome and super stylish and I love it. So speaking of Louis Vuitton, I recently actually um, started getting into like the Louis Vuitton small leather goods and I purchased the Louis Vuitton um, like mini key holder and I also purchased a coach one as well. But I went looking on Amazon. And I was like, I wonder if they have something similar. And I actually purchased this before I purchased the authentic one to make sure that I really loved it. And so this is a knockoff Louis Vuitton like little key holder. And pretty a lot of brands sell these, but they're super cute. Now about this one, one of these little clips did break off. So that's like the downside to this one being like the cheaper one. But I mean, it's made so so well and I was kind of pulling on that clip because I put my wrong key on there so I think it was my fault that it pulled out so I don't really want to talk about it and say that the quality isn't good because I think the quality is really good so this is a six ring six rings right a six ring key holder so you can put six keys in here um, I I love this thing I've been using my coach one because I kind of like my coach one a little better than the, the Louis Vuitton one that I have so I've been using my coach one and I really love the coach one because it does have like a little 
a little key ring down here to hold my bigger key like my car key fob but you can put like your normal keys in here you can put like the little the little um what do you call it? The little smart tags that you get from your local stores where you're a part of their rewards program. The little rewards tags, you can put those in here. I have my, um, like all of my keys fit in here. I only have like four keys and they all fit in here so nicely. And it's just really, really cute to have in your purse. And it helps stop your keys from like scratching up your nice handbags on the inside. So I, I'm so in love with this. So if you don't wanna spend the money on a designer version, go to Amazon and they have the little Louis Vuitton knockoff which is awesome another product that I got that I'm absolutely in love with is something else that's great for travel and it's this little all-in-one travel wallet so this is really awesome because you can put like your passport in here if you're taking checks with you I don't know why people still write checks but if you're taking checks with you you can put them in here you can put some cash in here your boarding pass there's like a pen loop for a pen right here and everything just kind of fits in this one pocket or in this one wallet it also has this like little it also has this little zippered pocket so if you have any coins or change you can also stick that in there so I really love this probably more so when I'm at the airport and I need everything in one place I need my passport my boarding pass my debit card I need it all in one single place this is really nice to have because uh, everything's in one place and you don't have to go searching through your purse or your bags you'll pull this out and you know you have everything in here plus a pen if you're going out of the country to fill out those custom forms I'm always looking for a pen so this is really nice to have everything right there so the next item is an electronic I get all of my filming equipment from Amazon like all of it so I always have again it linked below in the description box if you're ever wondering what filming equipment that I use but this is one of the little guys that I've been using um, probably for the last six to eight months and it has been amazing so this is the DJI Osmo pocket camera I don't exactly know it, you know it'll be down below but I don't exactly know what it's called but again the DJI Osmo pocket camera and so it looks like this it is a tiny like mini pocket camera and I use this a lot on like my vlogs and stuff like that like when I'm vlogging in a store so I don't have to take my regular vlogging camera which is the Canon G7X I'll take the DJI Osmo pocket and this camera is so nice because it has the quality of that camera even the microphone quality is really good, but it's super small, so no one knows what I'm doing. Sometimes vlogging can be kind of awkward, you know? So when you're in a store and you don't want everyone to know what you're doing, I literally just have this like camera on and people have no idea what it is. Sometimes people will ask, but people have no idea what it is or what I'm doing, and, and it's really awesome. It also has a built-in gimbal, so when you're moving, the camera still stays steady and consistent. So I love this camera. I use it all the time and um, it wasn't cheap but it was one of the best investments that I have ever made I just I love this camera so as I mentioned to you guys I am pregnant so I do have two items that have been like staples throughout my entire pregnancy the first has been my pregnancy pillow I'll put a picture of it right here on the screen so you guys can see it if you're pregnant I highly recommend some type of body contour pillow to really help you get comfortable help you sleep help you relax help your bones stop aching like every time I don't use this pillow my back is hurting when I wake up from being asleep so I sleep on this pillow every single night it's huge in my bed but it's fine I I just absolutely love snuggling up against it it gives me a nice like straight like like my body is just straight when I'm sleeping you know I'm not like dipped down on one side and my back doesn't hurt when I use it and this has literally been the best investment that I've made since getting pregnant I think the pillow was like $35 so not really that expensive especially when you're talking about you know it stops your back from hurting <laughs> but it's seriously one of my favorite items and I can't live without it and then along with that I actually picked up this belly band so for those of you who don't know a belly band is really nice because it kind of it fits over your stomach kind of helps align your back but then also once your pants start getting like tight or you can't bu buckle them anymore you can put the belly band on top of, top of them and you can still wear your regular jeans for a period of time so I love this it also helps if you have like a shorter shirt on it kind of helps elongate the shirt 
shirt because it goes over your butt a little bit. And so this is one of the best belly bands that I've tried. It's the Blanky brand, B-L-A-N-Q-I. And um, it was a little expensive. It was like $38, which I only spent like $10 on my other belly bands, but this one doesn't roll up at the bottom either, which I hate, hate, hate. This one doesn't roll up, it doesn't move, and it's just super comfortable. So I would totally recommend this if you're looking for something if you're pregnant, if you're looking for a band. Okay, let's talk about clothes and shoes. So for clothes, I, I've seriously gotten into Amazon clothes this year. I've bought shirts, I've bought leggings, I've bought dresses, i bought all types of stuff. Um, but my absolute favorite clothing items have been these Sherpa jackets. So I've bought maybe three or four off of Amazon, but my favorite one is right here. I'm sorry about the sun, y'all. But my favorite one is right here. This is one that I recently got maybe a month ago, and it looks like this. It is a long Sherpa jacket, so it comes past my knees. Doesn't have a zipper, which is fine though, because I just wear a nice scarf with it and a sweater, and it's really cute. I got mine in a size medium, and it fits so well. I'm gonna put a picture of it so you guys can see it right here on the model on Amazon, but it was super cheap. It was like $35, and so I was like, I have to have that. And I've been wearing it ever since, and I just feel so cute and so glam in that coat. I love it. But I also got a few other Sherpa jackets that I've just kind of been in love with. So I've gotten those all from Amazon. They've all been cheap. Some of them have been Amazon Prime. Some have not. So you just have to watch. But they've all been free shipping. They just sometimes take maybe two or three weeks. So for shoes, these are more like fitness adventure related, but I was looking for some water shoes because when we went to, where we go, Cancun? I think it was in Cancun last year. Um, it was early 2019, so it was like February. We went to Cancun and um, I needed water shoes for some of this water sports that we were doing. And so I bought these water shoes from Amazon because I knew we were going to Cabo and we had planned to do some of the same things in September, but then I ended up getting pregnant. Y'all know the story. So anyway, <laughs> I purchased these before I knew I was pregnant when I thought we would be doing some water sports. And so these are just water shoes they're super flexible so they don't take up space in your travel bag like you can literally fold them up like this but they're really nice because they're comfortable on the feet they have a hard bottom and so any type of water sports you're doing is fine for it, but you can also use them on land, which is really nice because had we did go do the water sports, I wouldn't have had to change my shoes during the excursion. I would have been able to do the entire excursion in these shoes. So these were, were pretty cheap. I think they were like 20 bucks, but I just thought these were everything because I had to do our water excursion in tennis shoes last time and it just was not the best. So I'm so happy I found these because we are going on another trip later this year and we plan on doing some water excursions so I will have these handy. I also use these when we go to like the water park so we'll go to like an indoor water park. I'll also use these as well because the bottom of those pools really hurt my feet. These help them to not hurt so bad. All right, so let's keep this train moving since that was like a semi-fitness item. Let's keep going with the fitness stuff. I do have these cycling shoes as well that I purchased from Amazon. So um, before I got pregnant, I was heavy into cycling. So I was going to cycling class like once or twice a week at different places. And these, if you are going to cycle, you need some cycling shoes. I mean, the bottom of your feet hurts so bad if you don't have the proper shoes for cycling. And so it's to the point where I can barely finish the workout if I don't have them. So I finally broke down. Like I, I have so many pairs of workout shoes, you guys, it's crazy. So I didn't want to buy I didn't want to buy new shoes like just for cycling. But once I started doing it, I realized I really needed it. So I broke down and bought these shoes. These are the Gavin brand and um I mean, they're so comfortable on the feet and they're a fraction of the cost of what if you go to like Dick's or um, somewhere else that sells cycling shoes and exercise equipment, they're a fraction of the cost from what I've seen because I've seen these run upwards of $100. Wanna say I got these for like $35 and I haven't had any problems with them whatsoever. I don't wear them outside. I only wear them when I am cycling at like a cycling class. So um, yeah, you can literally get everything from Amazon. 
And then the next thing is a sweat belt. I have bought several of these over the years, but this brand in particular is my favorite. And this is the Sweet Sweat Waist Trimmer. And it just helps you sweat. I put it around my waist and it really does just help me sweat more. It helps, like I feel like my stomach is sweating more, sweating off some of that fat, honey. I'll be using this as soon as I drop this baby. I will be using this during my workouts to make sure that I am sweating as as much as possible and getting all the water weight and the toxins and everything out of my body. It just really helps for that. I love it. Also, fun fact, anytime, like sometimes I'll forget a sports bra, like I'll pack my gym bag and forget to put a sports bra in it. I will put this around my chest area with my regular bra and still go to my workouts and literally it stays because you just tighten it. You tighten it super tight and it stays put and it helps your boobs from like <laughs> jumping up and down if you guys know what I mean. So if you ever forget your sports bra but you have one of these, Fun fact, you can use it. Um, and then the last kind of fitness related item is this Herbalife Healthy Meal Formula One Nutritional Meal Shake. And I've shown you guys this before when I was like heavy on my fitness. This summer, if you guys were following me on Instagram, I was posting workout videos like every day because I was at the gym like every day. And so this is one of the meal replacement shakes that I would use and I had just bought a new one when I found out I was pregnant. I was like, damn. So this one is still full. When does this even go bad? I mean, it doesn't go bad till November of this year, so I still have time to use it once uh, I have this baby. But uh, yeah, so this was so good. It just tastes like a chocolate milkshake. I'd put a banana in it, some powder, and then some soy milk, blend it all up in my blender, and I would just have a great meal replacement shake. So I love that stuff. It was kind of expensive. It was like $35, but I didn't mind paying it because one, I didn't wanna go through an Herbalife distributor because I feel like, I don't know, I just feel like that's more of a hassle than it's worth when I could just buy it from Amazon. So that's what I did and that was my second bottle of it and when I tell you guys, I was running through that stuff because I was using it like every day as a meal replacement. So I really love that Formula One nutritional mix. So one of my favorite products lately has been this Filofax. This is the A5 Filofax Domino something or another. And I have been in love with this. First of all, I love the pink color. It's just super cute. I keep this in my purse at all times. It houses my everyday planner and notebook. If you guys haven't seen my video with my 2020 planner lineup and flip through, I will make sure that is linked in this video up here in the cards so you guys can check it out. But this is what I've been using and have just been absolutely loving. I love, I mean, I love the feel of it. I love how chic it looks. I love that it has this little rubber band to keep it closed. It has a pen loop. Um, this is just amazing. Filofax is a pretty expensive brand when it comes to like planner stuff. So to find this on Amazon for like 30 bucks was awesome. They had different sizes and I made this into my own little traveler's notebook, which I still need to fix these holes, but I made it into my own little traveler's notebook and um yeah i just thought this thing is awesome so i use it every single day and i love it all right we gotta hurry this up because this song will not let me be great okay <laughs> so i lied i do have one more fitness item and it is this squat bar right here i'm gonna put a picture of it it's in the basement and in our gym and i just don't feel like going to get it okay give a pregnant lady some slack so this squat bar is everything i cannot squat on a squat machine without it the squat machine is very heavy it hurts you your neck and I just can't do it so this summer when I was going to the gym really heavy I did purchase this squat bar it was like nine dollars and I take it to the gym with me every single time I go and it just makes squatting so much more comfortable for your neck so that is definitely a must-have so this is a clothing item but I still kind of used it for the gym and this is a like tie back halter top shirt literally you put it on and tie the back of it so your entire back is out there's like a whole back out almost and then you have a tie at the bottom and it's just really really cute I thought these shirts were so so cute I'm gonna put pictures of myself with the shirts on because I had so many of them and so I'm gonna put pictures of myself with the shirts on in the video so you guys can see just how cute these shirts are not only that but they were super 
super stretchy so it just made it really easy to put on it fit of fits a variety of body types I think and I just love those shirts those are my absolute favorite workout shirts so my last two items, first being this mannequin head. This may look a little strange, you guys. So I just have like my T-pins in here, which I also got from Amazon. But this mannequin head, I don't know how I live life making wigs without it because anytime I need to bleach some knots, make a wig, if I need to flat iron the wig before it's on my head or curl it or whatever the case, I will use this mannequin head and I have a stand for it. And so I'll put the mannequin head on a stand, put the wig on the head, and then I'll do any type of styling or anything that I need to do and it just makes it so much easier to do when it's actually on a head which is what it will be on when you put it on right so for all of my wig makers for all of my my wig stylers this canvas mannequin head has been a lifesaver for me I I just absolutely love it I use it every single time I do anything with the wig and um, I got mama all messed up up here but it's okay because this is my personal mannequin head and I I mean it's helped me so much in like my wig making journey and last but not least, I'm pretty sure I've shown you guys this before. I have this like canvas duffel bag. And so I'm gonna also put a picture up here cause like I said, the sun, but I got this canvas duffel bag for travel. I bought this earlier in 2019 and that bag, I take it every single time I travel. It's like my little carry on companion because it fits a lot of stuff, but it doesn't get super heavy for some reason. Like I feel like sometimes when I have duffel bags, they just feel super heavy or they they distribute the weight and the products awkwardly and so they're awkward to hold sometimes if that makes any type of sense that duffel bag I feel like does not do that it does have a structured bottom on it and it's just really cute like I love the stripe pattern it's really cute so that's a such a great travel companion if you're looking for like a small carry-on or a small duffel bag or maybe you're going on an overnight trip that bag is perfect all right, you guys, so that is it. Those are my top 19 Amazon products for 2019. Let me know what your favorite product was from Amazon last year. I'd love to put more things on my shopping list because your girl goes Amazon crazy all the time. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed Favorites Month. Thank you for your love. Thank you for all of your support. And I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye guys.